Hey guys, I'm going to be doing a walk around. This is one of my dad's truck cranes. It's a telecrane. As you can see on the boom telecrane, I'm not sure what the model number is. I'll have to ask my dad on that. Anyway, uh, let's start over here. Here's your two hooks that go up to the hook block. I think this is a 15 ton truck crane. Anyway, here's your headlights. Uh, those are, I believe, yeah. For a second, I thought there were reflectors, I'm not sure. Some more lights. Here's your grill. Here's another grill. On the other side. Here's your hook block. As most people know, you have to push this in, safety thing. And uh, there's your sheaves. Or whatever. Uh, yeah. Here's the other side. Here's another marker. Logo. Here's your steerable tire. This is just a one steer tire. Here's a step. Get up over there to service the engine. There's a little walkway right in here. Here's a mirror. Here's the boom arm again. Here's that cab. I'll be able to get into the cab here in a second. Here's uh, one of your stabilizers. Obviously it pushes out. And then here's uh, three uh, controls. I believe they, uh, I'm not sure what, exactly which one, which one does. There's another set of them over there, so I'm thinking that, like it pulls, pulls the outriggers out or something like, no you do. Um, I'm not sure what it's for. There's a reflector. Here are some chains and hooks and stuff. Here's like a, I believe this is a step, different type of step. Here's your uh, crane cab to operate the machine. It's locked right now. Or, well, it's not locked, but it's probably rusted shut. I'll try to get into it. It's kind of hard to get into this crane because you have to step up here. I barely can. And I'm like five foot four. I, can, I barely can. So it's kind of hard to get up onto. That's probably why they had that step there, so you can just walk around and step up into it. Anyway, here's your rear two tires. Here's another stabilizer. Some hydraulic hoses leading up to the stabilizer. Here's your counterweight that says Bantam on it. As you can see, it's not that big of a counterweight. And here's your uh, holes. I forgot what those are for. Oh, bolt holes. And then here's two rear hooks. Here's another stabilizer. Here's your brake light right there. Two marker lights or reflectors, not sure. Here's your uh, DOT stripping here. Here's another side of steps. Some more chains and hooks. Same thing on each side. Ignore what I just kicked. Um, here's some more of those. Here's some fluid tanks, I believe what they are. Here's some wood and here's the uh, Stabilizer for the boom when it's transport mode. Uh, hold on. I'm gonna go up in here here in a second. There we go. It's an old crane. You could dad just put this here just because. Anyway, I'm not gonna get up into it. But anyway, here's your uh, right in there. There's your speedometer. Here's just some uh, buttons and things. Uh, lights. Here's your foot pedals. Here's where you sit. Doesn't look very comfy. Suppose that's your gear shift. There's your steering wheel and there's like your turn lights and your four ways. Anyway, that's what the inside of this thing looks like. Not that nice of a crane. He never he hasn't used it in a really long time. As you can see, I have to hit it back down. Okay, there's a train going by, but ignore it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here. Make sure you guys are in this part. Anyway, here is your other cab. You can see it's fogged up, can't really see anything. Anyway, here are some uh, things running in the back. 
you know, you have your airbags, shock absorbers back there. Here's one of the two hydraulics that lift the boom. Here's your fluid lines or oil, whatever lines. And uh, here's some hoses laid up to the boom so it can extend out, as you can see. That's what it looks like in there again. But anyway, that's basically what uh, this crane looks like. It's not that nice of a crane, he never uses it. He uses his RT cranes now. Anyway, there it is. A telecrane, truck crane, not sure what the number is. If I find out, I'll put it in the info box. Thanks, guys.